Um, not quite as common this far to the north, but I mean last year, what, March 5th, uh, we had those devastating tornadoes roll through. And you look at Friday, again, there's a chance we could see strong to severe storms roll through. This is the map highlighting that bullseye, which right now sits in the eastern portion of the state. So really Grinnell eastward all the way down through St. Louis into Arkansas. So still a lot in play with this system and a lot of uncertainty with the track and timing and even intensity of it. But Friday is definitely going to be a day to watch uh, as we get a little bit closer. You can see even the metros on the edge of that area of risk right now, though, not too bad. A little chilly 26 is where we sit. That feels like temperature is at 17. Otherwise, we're relatively clear skied. We've got some clouds to the northwest and to the southeast. Those have been keeping folks to the southeast anyway, a little warmer 30 for Ottumwa as well as center. We've got teens off to the west in Atlantic and again winds have been very light, but they've been enough to uh, knock those feels like temperatures down. Some of us not even in the teens 10 for Spencer Atlantic at 11 again the metro at 17 looking at your 12 hour forecast back up into the mid to upper 40s this afternoon. We'll likely keep a few stray clouds around, but I do think we'll work in quite a bit of sunshine out there for your day. You can see just kind of the hit or miss clouds that we've got and those increase this evening and then will generally decrease throughout the day tomorrow. But heading in towards Wednesday, we'll have a chance for some folks to the north to pick up on more chances for snow looking light at this point, not looking like the nine inches that some of us saw um, over the weekend. But as we head throughout the end of the week here, you can see that next system taking shape, likely going to rain, maybe even storm for much of the day on Thursday. And then on Friday, again, a lot of uncertainty with this. You can see models putting the strongest area off to the east. The dry air again, if that works its way in a little bit quicker and cuts this off. All these things we have to consider as we get a little bit closer to the to the end of the week, but it definitely a day to keep an eye on for us uh, as we work our way there. Middle 60s Thursday and Friday. We are sunny on Saturday.